Drew, when did you first start on the show? Uh, let's see, filmed my first, well, I was playing an extra, playing uh, O'Sullivan, uh, cop, uh, in 2000. I remember that. Sully? I was, uh, Sully, yeah, o- O'Sullivan. I remember the name tag being like, this feels right. Uh, <laughs> uh, how it all really started, though, I, I was very, you know, I just was uh, new in L.A. And, uh, you know, with Steve, for those that don't know, I, I, I grew up knowing Steve uh, as an older brother figure. Um, so Dirk, my brother, Max, would bring Steve back when I was in the seventh, eighth, ninth grade. They would travel back. I don't know what you guys were doing, just road tripping. Yeah, we cheap, were just... What? Cheaper, yeah, but- cheaper, cheaper beer in Ohio. You're from Ohio, right? Yeah, it's from five cent beer nights. Yeah. Yeah. That's Bowling Green, yeah. Ohio. Dirk and I would hit the road together. I'd go do an appearance. I remember we were in Tennessee. We went to Tennessee to do an appearance. And then yep. we, and then I had a couple of days off. He's like, Hey, let's, we started driving somewhere. Like we started driving to Florida or something. He's like, why don't we just go to Ohio? I'm like, all right, turn around. Yep. And then we just roll out to Ohio for three days. We'd come in like a freaking, tornado and and drew's like what the hell's going on and we play basketball and do a bunch of crazy stuff and you yep. know but it was uh, it was always a blast going back to see your mom and dad too so yeah so steve and i um you know besides me schooling him in basketball which i still to this day which is not even close to the truth but go ahead true but i like to own it uh, they would come back and i got to you know know steve as kind of an older brother uh figure so i I had a connection to the show when I moved out there through, you know, my brother and then my cousin, uh, Tyler, Nick, Tyler, Christopher, Tyler, Tyler Christopher, Christopher was your cousin. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. 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 Yep. So Tyler was on then Steve was on. So Dirk would just take me up to set when I visited out there as a kid. And then I uh, just got to know everybody kind of, you know, just know, uh, who's, I didn't really know who's who. I just knew that there was a um, super cool. To, I was very interested in acting. I, I liked the whole performance. And at that time it was sports for me, uh, but I always liked performing. I thought how cool, you know, these guys get to like, man, it just seems like a um, super cool. I even thought art then there was a magic about it that I just really recognized at a very early age. And so then when we, when, you know, when Bradford started and even before that, it was, uh, you know, it was just, it, we were just hanging out, having the greatest right. time ever. Like it was just like a, a club. Like we were just, it was like a country club. You go to work at a country club. You're like, Hey, cool. What are we doing after? Oh, let's go do whatever. Right. It was amazing. So, yeah. Yeah. I would say I was even a part of, you know, in 2005. I mean, I think it carried over for a long time when Bradford came on. I mean, yeah, for sure. Me and, me and Bradford became, you know, fast friends. Um, Absolutely. I'll never forget the, uh, one of his first days on set. And of course he was getting like, I, you probably still do, but I mean, you were getting like monologues of crazy dialogue. Oh. Right. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah. I remember my brother and I were, we were working with you and I was like, I knew you had a good personality. I knew you were a fun guy. And I was like, I was trying to, me and my brother were trying to have fun with you. And of course we probably had like two lines a day. So we're, we're all good. We're just like, <laughs> and Brad, I remember you just like going through your stuff and you're like, you have your script and you're just going through everything just dialed in right and i'm like Why right like really want to like mix it up i know he's like i think we were like mixed it up the day before and you're having a great time oh you're like oh he's just a jerk maybe uh, well no i was just like like what's going on and then like literally that day i saw all your dialogue and all the stuff you were saying uh-huh. and i was just like that's that's i remember being like <laughs> with you and like watching what you were saying i was like oh that's why <laughs> like, that's why dude, like dude's focus trying to get his stuff right because as we know like if you've got a ton of stuff and the way we, you know we move oh yeah if you get tripped yeah. up on your stuff and you know you got a ton of stuff i mean you're gonna be there I mean, yeah, yeah. There's, no, there's no me- there's no messing around for sure no 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 and and that was uh man i i, I learned that day just you just really put a lot so much into it and you have to i mean especially with that with that amount, you know, of, I, I, I approached it, I think one time where I had, I think uh, close to what you guys consistently kind of do. And um, yeah, it's just, it's, it's, it's a lot. So I was just, that was one of my first impressions of uh, just, yeah, your work ethic be rad. And just, um, it was cool. It was cool to see. Yeah. We, hey man, awesome. we had a, we had, we had a really fun time. Like I, uh, you know, once, you know, once you came on and, and you, you and Dirk were doing stuff, they, when, you know, when Scott Clifton was on the show as Dylan yep. and we all kind of had, an, yeah. Who, had who was your guys's kind of crew? 
what what like who was in your cert was it was that julie berman was right. it you're talking about like how what our characters were doing yeah kind of like who were yeah. you what was your orbit who who's yeah so that? so we all were pining for lulu and ah, got they it. would they and i think i it was like bill adele was was kind of i think maybe behind some of this every time we had kind of one of those like these the three stooges kind of scenes where we're bumbling over trying to <laughs> win the affection of lulu but that's kind of what happened that was yeah that's kind of what happened it was like these three dummies and i i, I specifically remember, remember a scene where they were like we were all responding to her and it, it, the the direction was like hey Scott, you go this way. Bradford, you go th this way. Drew, you go this way. And it was like, do, do, do. <laughs> yeah. of, I, of course, that was Bill Ludell. It had to be. Of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, For I'm sure. I'm percent sure that it was. For right. sure. And to this day, yeah, Scott Clifton still says some of his finest work. <laughs> <laughs> Please subscribe to our YouTube channel.